All right, guys, so now let's look at another entry into top lock, this time using that same pendulum motion that we were talking about in the last couple of clips. Okay, so same motion that we would use to hit a pendulum sweep, only this time we feel that maybe we're unable to sweep. Um, and so we just go in and we start locking up a conventional top lock. So um, we come out, let's take this. When we go into the, uh, to the, to the grab, okay, on the, so to grab our training corner at the head, I usually like to do it swimming the hand inside. Um, this is right now, my partner's elbows are, are high. Sometimes his elbows might be low, and in which case we have to lift our hips and look to punch a hand through and then grab here. And now when he goes to pull up, we just keep a hold of the head long enough that we can scoop into the leg and then go. Um, other times we might have to do it off balancing our training partner. So it's gonna be kind of dependent upon the situation where we are in the grip fight, uh, sometimes he's trying to get a hold of my wrists. We're coming out, maybe we're fighting here, and whatever the case is, we bump our training partner's hand to the floor, and then we get it to our, our training partner's head. So it's not always going to be from an artificial situation where I just swim my hand inside, but there's going to be many opportunities as we're grip fighting that our hands come in and we can just catch the collar. Okay, so just keep that in mind here. Now, from here, when I get to the head, we come through and we start that pendulum action. Sometimes we hit the pendulum multiple times. But regardless, we get into this position here. Now, right from here, maybe my partner posts the leg up, or maybe I feel that I'm unable to, 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 to sweep him for whatever the, for whatever reason. From here, we're just gonna take our knee to the back of his head and we're just gonna lock up this top block here. Okay. So now when my partner goes to yank out of this, it's very, very tough for him to do so. Okay. Um, from here, your partner will usually try his best whenever he can to connect their hands, okay? Because they are in a top lock. So from here, they're gonna wanna connect their hands. So provide, no, no, go back, good. So provided he can go in and connect his hands. Now from here, we just go into our regular top lock stuff that we saw before, okay? We could try to go in and pendulum him again. We could try to go in, start separating the hands. We could try to go in for figure four top locks. What, block hands, good, whatever the case is, okay? So we're in this position, we start playing from here. We could start looking to go in, and throw legs over the head and start sending our training partner over. We play our usual top lock game from there. Okay, so we come out, we bring a hand to the inside, we scoop into the leg, and we hit one pendulum. Sometimes we'll have to hit two, three, and stay down. Four, until we can get out into this position here. Okay, so my whole thing is to get our hips perpendicular. Now from here, we lock our top lock, and now we're in good position to start going in and threatening our training partner sending them down to the floor, going into our conventional top lock attacks from there. So just another entry into the top lock. We saw passing the elbow across and going with the elbow and the head. We can also go in and do it um, from a pendulum motion going into the top.